What's up everyone, it's Teen here from Tutorial Sub and in this video I want to show you how to convert any Figma design to HTML and CSS for absolutely free with this tool called Builder.io. Now with this tool, if you sign up to Builder.io, you will uh, basically want to connect uh, your Figma first. So first you want to click on develop space here. So continue with develop. And then as you can see here, they will just ask you, you know, who you are, marketer, designer, I'll just put marketer for now. And as you can see right here, you can actually install this plugin within Figma. You have 13 days free uh, trial left in pro plan, which is enough for you to generate or convert Figma design that you have to HTML and CSS. Now we go get plugin here. And as you can see, the plugin will be called uh, right here. Let's see. So as you can see, Builder.io, we open this in and then we have recent files here. So this is an untitled file. So let me just go here and let me rename this to test for video one. And uh, then let's just refresh this and let's open it in a test for video one. I think there's actually no other files here. So let's just go with this one and then let's go here. And what we can do, let me just exit out of it. What we can do is we can actually, let me just do it like this. So we can actually go to plugins, manage plugins. And here we have builder IO. And then we have this one. So we run this one. And as you can see here, go from design to code 50 to 80% faster. So here, as you can see, guide me. And then as you can see, get precise controls with auto layout, map your design system, and then explicitly define images. So as you can see now, we have this selection, which is our entire selection. We can also do it like this, right? And then fix. And then as you can see here, we can export it to code. So we just click export to code. And you know, this will be pretty much it, right? We upload images. And now we go to builder IO and inside of builder IO, as you can see, we have this right here. Now, obviously this is just for the, um, this is for the desktop, but you actually have to see this in the desktop. You can get your code right here so you can generate a code. So you can click generate code. If this persists, what you can do is you can simply go and refresh the website and you can add the, the, the language to be JavaScript and here styling to be CSS. And then obviously if it again persists, uh, sometimes that happens. Uh, so then what you can do is you can play around with these, but again, in the edit here, you can also add a prompt to generate what you want. Now, another way how you can, uh, add or how you can turn or convert your design Figma design to HTML and CSS is to use something called bolt.new. So bolt.new is a, um, is an AI coder. So what you can do is you can add an image. So let's say we have this right here and what we can do is let's zoom out like this. And what we can do is we can screenshot this and then we can add this to bolt.new. This is completely free. You have, I think seven to eight prompts. So if the first, the version is not working, you can go here. Can you recreate this entire design as it is in CSS and HTML? And then it will basically recreate your entire design inside of the, uh, you know, HTML and CSS, as you can see. And then you can also export this later down the line, download it, or you can deploy it or you can run it online on a subdomain, which is really awesome. So as you can see right here, it will basically design this for us, as you can see. So obviously it, it's not the same design, right? Because it's AI, uh, but it's pretty much pretty close design, right? So if you want something that is again, free, but closer to what you have right here, then you can basically go here and you can play around with this. You can say, uh, actually, this isn't, this isn't the same design. Can you make it the exact same? And then you can play around with prompts, obviously on that. 
Now, usually builder.io works the best for this. Uh, so if it doesn't work, again, you can either contact their support right here on the, on the, um, here on the give feedback section. But let's see what Bold New can um, fix right here. And we can end off the video here on that. Now, as you can see, here's the preview, right? So it kind of did similar thing, but again, the more prompts you have, the better the, uh, the end product will be. So that's what you can do. Uh, in terms of this, you have all other plugins as well for this. So you can manage plugins and you can always go like uh, Figma to HTML, HTML. This is also like HTML to design, like that can be, or Figma to HTML, that can be also great. Like if you go here and if you run this, you can also do that, like you can convert and here you have HTML legacy and then you can, you know, please select the artboard. Obviously we'll need to select the artboard, right? So if we have this, we can just hit convert and then that will convert us to HTML as well. So you have a couple of options that I showed in this video again. Um, you know, if you want to learn more about the, um, you know, AI, uh, more about, um, you know, tutorials on AI, comment down below and check out our channel. And yeah, hopefully you learned something new and we'll see you in the next video.